Right now on KKL News on CBS Los Angeles, SoCal on storm watch tonight as Hillary barrels toward California, bringing with it a chance of heavy rain, strong winds and thunderstorms. And we're dealing with hot and humid conditions now, but that could quickly change. Hillary is a hurricane now. You can see how large it is as it turns off the coast of Mexico tonight. Let's get right to meteorologist Evelyn Tav. She's got the latest on what we can expect from Hillary. Yeah. And Pat, I mean, currently Hillary's a category three storm. And once it gets here, it will be the remnants of Hillary. It'll be a post tropical low, basically. So it just means we will get that tropical moisture. Won't technically be a hurricane or a tropical storm, but it will pack a lot of wind and a lot of rain. It could kind of be uh, attributed to maybe half a rain event and half a Santa Ana event, a combination of the two. So we could see some serious damage, flooding, and again, just rain and a lot of it, a very big concern. As we get a look at Hurricane Hillary right now, as I mentioned, it is a category now four storm that just changed in the last few moments. It was a category three storm. We're now at a category four strength winds at 140 miles per hour and continuing to churn to the west northwest at 14 miles per hour. So it's at its peak strength right now as it remains offshore. It's going to start hugging the Baja coastline as we head into the next couple of days. And once it gets here, we are in the forecast cone. We'll tell you exactly what that means. Of course, it won't be a hurricane by the time it gets to Southern California, but we are expecting a lot of rain and a lot of wind. We could see four to eight inches even of rain in some spots. Last year, we had a similar occurrence with K, but it only really made its way to San Diego County as far as the heavy rain went and the wind well, we're expecting it to make its way to LA County now. We're going to explain exactly what that'll entail for your neighborhood in just a little bit, but for now, Pat, back to you.